Hey, welcome back. We're in the Gospel of Luke, and today, kind of a difficult one here. We're going to do verses 40 to 42, and then there's kind of an interruption we'll do with that tomorrow, and we're going to do verse 49 and 50. So let's just take this one that's kind of an odd split here. Verse 40 and onward. So it was when Jesus returned that the multitude welcomed him, for they were all waiting for him. And behold, there was a man named Jairus, and he was a ruler of the synagogue, and he fell down at Jesus' feet and begged him to come to his house. For he had an only daughter about 12 years of age, and she was dying. But as he went, the multitudes thronged him. So now we're going to jump ahead and skip over the story we'll talk about tomorrow. Verse 49 and 50. While he, while Jesus was still speaking, someone came from the ruler of the synagogue's house, saying to him, Your daughter is dead. Do not trouble the teacher. But when Jesus heard it, he answered him, saying, Do not be afraid, only believe, and she will be made well. Wow, that's, that's pretty intense. Jesus is going to call forth some, some real faith from this guy. So, uh, again, we'll be finishing this story in two days, but let's look at what we have here. So the multitude is looking, as soon as Jesus gets back, they're, they're there. They're, there's a whole group. They're all there. And here comes the guy from the synagogue, begs at Jesus' feet, come to heal my daughter. Jesus immediately goes. And now he's going to be way late on the way, and we'll just go ahead and get that out of the way tomorrow. That's a wild story as well. But Jesus is coming. Jesus is coming, but he's not going to get there in time. So we go over to jump to 49 now. He's being told uh, while he's still speaking, don't. Don't, don't trouble him anymore. She's dead. There's nothing more that can be done for her. And Jesus has good news for this guy. Uh, yes, there is. I'm still coming, and I'm going to make her well. Like, what? Does Jesus have wax in his ears? Hey, this, this woman, this girl is dead. Well, but that doesn't stop Jesus. He, he just, he's always busy stopping funerals, isn't he? So we'll come to that here two days. But right now, uh, gracious that Jesus, when you call for Jesus, he will come. He will come. But he, he may, might not come in in the timing you wanted, but it's okay because when Jesus comes, it will be the right timing every time. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, we want to trust you in your timing. Jesus was busy along the way, waylaid, ministering at every, at every step along the way, and this is still going to come out beautifully and as a witness to your love, your great grace and love for us, your great mercy. So Lord, help us to have faith as uh, the ruler of the synagogue did, help us to have faith even when it seems like time has run out. Time may not have run out, Lord, because if it's your will, you will deliver anyway. Thank you for being this God, this God. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Death is not a hindrance to he who resurrects. May God's blessing be upon you today.